hello everyone welcome to my first video tutorial in this video i am going to show you how you can create an image recognition web api using tensorflow and fast api fast api is a high performance asynchronous framework for building apis in python its performance is similar to that of node.js and go development time in fast api is much less than other frameworks like flask Fast API has a great documentation. The best place to start with Fast API is its documentation. In this API, the client will send an image to the server and the server will return the class of the object as the response. And the server will read or decode the image uploaded by the user. After the image is decoded and loaded into a suitable format, the server will do some pre-processing on the image, like resize the image and normalize the pixel values. Finally, the deep learning model will do inference on the model and we will get the class of the image. Now let's create the server.py program module in which we will contain our API code. We will import fast API class from our fast API module and then create an object app is equal to fast API. In fast API to create a get request API, we use app.get annotation. Similarly, for post request, we use app.post annotation and for put, we use app.put annotation. This index is nothing but just a hello world program. We will get hello world when we hit this API from our browser or postman or swagger. To run this app, import avcon. avcon is an ASGI framework for Python. If name is main, avcon.run, app, you can pass host and port here, it is not necessary, it, or it picks the default configuration, which is local host and I think 80 or 8000 for port. Now just run the app. Okay, got some error. Oh. Okay, port is not string, it should be passed as an integer. Port is equal to 8. Now let's hit the URL to our browser and we get hello world. Now I will make the API to return my name instead of hello world. For this, pass an argument in hello world function. To send the name from the browser, I will append name is equal to Aniket in the URL and the API will return the response hello Aniket. Now I will create my image classification API. It will be a post request. The API name will be API slash image predict or api slash predict for file upload we first import file from fast api and upload file and we pass this as an argument to the predict method We decode the image, we apply some pre-processing and then we do model inference on the image. In the prediction.py module, I will write the code for model loading, image decoding, image pre-processing and prediction code. Read image method will decode the image uploaded by the client and load it as a python below object. Now I will read the image uploaded by the client using the method I just created.
now create the pre-process method its input will be image object that is below image object first define the input shape of the image it will be 224 is to 224 height and width since I will be using mobile net v2 architecture it is trained on image net 224 into 224 image size For normalization, I will divide it by 127.5 and subtract it from 1.0 now I will apply the pre-process image method in the main function create load model function model is equal to tf dot keras dot applications dot mobile net v2 and I will pass the input shape which is 22 for return model create the predict function it will accept the image of numpy array I'll use the model to make the prediction let's define the model above other function model is equal to load model And here model dot predict image predictions is equal to model dot predict image now import decode predictions from tensorflow dot keras dot applications let's check the official tensorflow documentation to see what is the return format of decode prediction method so here we can see it returns three list of three object values we are more interested in the first index wall value it will give us the object name or, or object class now load the swagger UI let me upload an image to check the model prediction okay 